Now you would have heard the term ride it down or drop underneath it, etc. And I want to explain that in a little bit more detail because we're kind of getting through these lessons to the point now where we're receiving the bar. And there's obviously that urge to want to oh, fly down into your catch position. However, I do coach people still to think about receiving the bar in this same position where we were catching it in the jump catches anyway, just so that we're in control of the bar before we hit the bottom position. Now that's really important. If we're in control of the bar here and the bar comes down on a straight line, it will exit on a straight line. So I want to explain that now. I'm going to draw you a little picture, but please excuse my handwriting and my drawing because I've got about the skill of a six-year-old and I'm being polite. Okay, so we're going to imagine now that we're facing in this direction, okay? This, for argument's sake, guys, is a nice straight line. Yes, I'm a left hooker, I know. Okay, and we're facing this way. Now, as the bar starts coming off the floor or from mid shin, it tracks back very slightly, okay? Now, when we get to hip height, which is here, the bar is projected straight up, it comes down over the head, and this is the point that I'm referring to where we were catching it a moment ago in that top position. From here, what we need is we need the bar to continue to come down straight in order for it to come up straight. And us finishing with the bar overhead. Now, if you imagine, should I do it? Should I try to do it? Yeah, fuck it, I'll try to do it. If you imagine, this is us in our bottom position of our snatch, bloody long back. Okay, our head is here, and then our arms are going up. If you imagine, in this position here, if the bar comes down straight, brilliant, we're able to stand up straight. However, what will commonly happen if you rush down into your catch position, is this bar will tend to loop like this. And then you don't hit full extension, and by the time you get underneath the bar, the bar, if it exit, it comes in this way, it's gonna exit the same way, and we're gonna miss it out the back. So by actively thinking about catching the bar at this point and going down with it into the bottom, it allows us to use the momentum to help us stand up and out the bottom position, which is extremely important for us to have a nice, efficient snatch, okay? So we don't wanna be sat stuck in this bottom position, because if we relax here, we're gonna miss a lift. And that is my explanation about riding the bar into the catch position. Now enjoy your workout.